Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve if your Google Chrome web browser is not working properly. So, I tend to do a yearly tutorial on something like this because sometimes I decide to change some of the methodology I use. So, that is basically what this tutorial is going to be today. So, we're going to jump right into it and we're going to start by opening up the Start menu. And you want to type in Computer or this PC, doesn't really matter, but depending on what version of Windows it maybe does, but you want to get to computer. Again, Windows 10 is probably going to say this PC. You want to go underneath wherever Windows is installed on, and it should say local disk. There should be a little Windows icon above the hard disk as a little sign here. So you want to double click to open that up. Double click on the program files folder right here. Double click on Google. Double click on Chrome. Double click on application. And now whatever version number is, there should be a folder for it. You want to double click on that. Now there should be something that says chrome.dll. You want to right click on it. And then left click on delete. Now you want to open up the recycling bin. Should be a chrome.dll file in here. Right click. And then left click on restore. It will say you'll need to provide administrative permissions to move this folder. Click on continue by left clicking on it. DLL file should reappear in here. Try going back on your Chrome browser and see if that resolves your issue. I'd also recommend if you're having internet connectivity problems, go type in CMD, right click on the best match from this list, and then left click on run as administrator. If you receive a user account control window, you can select yes. Now you want to type in ipconfig space forward slash release, R-E-L-E-A-S-E, -E -E. anyone hit enter? Now you want to type in ipconfig space forward slash flush DNS, exactly how it appears on my screen. Then you want to hit enter. Again, ipconfig space forward slash flush DNS. Should say successfully flush the DNS resolver cache. Once you're done doing that, type in ipconfig space forward slash renew then you want to hit enter on your keyboard now that you've typed that in you want to type in N-E-T-S-H space I-N-T space I-P space set DNS so N-E-T-S-H space I-N-T space I-P space Z and then one more space DNS. Then you want to enter on your keyboard. Once you're done typing that in, you want to type in N-E-T-S-H space Winsock space reset. So N-E-T-S-H space Winsock W-I-N-S-O-C-K space reset. Then you want to enter on your keyboard. And now I would recommend that you guys restart your computer. See if that has resolved your issue as well. Now, I would also recommend that none of those methods work for you. Just reinstall the browser itself. That would just entail going to the Start menu, typing in Uninstall, and then going underneath Uninstall Program here, and then just going and uninstalling Google Chrome and then reinstalling it once you've done that through another web browser. And that's another method as well, but again, that would probably be one of the last resort things I would try and do. But it's not that big of a deal. It shouldn't really be the end of the world, to be honest. But I do hope this brief tutorial was able to help you guys out, resolve your issue. And as always, thank you for watching, and I look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.